So the uh, probably get that better into view if it can be seen. CRT 2000, a new set for optimization from the same Sheffield customer. This is box 44, set five out of six. Uh, if you looked at the uh, adjustment video, not a lot you can adjust. Just uh, we brought the power output up and. Uh, deviation had been set by the the vendor so that was uh, more or less right we brought the uh, AM modulation up and there we go so we're on in tiny tiny little letters it says C31 which means channel 31 for some obscure reason which is beyond me it says 27.901 but it doesn't bother saying 2790125 so it ha can't be bothered to have enough digits but it shows the frequency which I really don't know why anybody wants to know because it's a channelized system. But there you go, that's me. I imagine a taxi company and, and it shows a display on the uh, showing the what frequency they're on. It's just bizarre. Anyway, Tango 21, just checking if you're out there. Okay, here's our first problem. Yeah, I found the menu with menu with volume on Chippy. Fancy having to do that. Right, yeah, Roger on that, you're passing the house. Uh, it doesn't have a tone control. I've just changed channel again because the single knob was in the wrong mode. I'm just not getting anywhere with the volume on this. Roger on that, got you at the end of the lane. So once again, I've gone and all it, it times out of being the volume control, it becomes channel. So you've got to make sure every time it's in volume mode. It's ridiculous. to make sure that you're not uh, splattering uh, but you don't appear to so when people hear this and they hear you disappearing it's me changing channel purposely yeah roger on that um yeah it's certainly um it's certainly towards the two and a half end of it um the supplying dealers adjusted it and uh, i just brought it down a little pad yep roger that we're now going through ancaster crossroads roger on that
Tango 21 from Mr. Chippy. We're now going around Scratchy Corner, Willsford, however. Roger, got you going around Scratchy Corner, Willsford. Tango 21 from Mr. Chippy. We're now going around Scratchy Corner. Roger, got you going around Scratchy Corner, Willsford. And I'm on a CRT 2000, current model, and it's doing 4-4-1 out for David. Yep, roger that, well received. Roger. Passing the Grayley's turn, over. Roger, got you at the Grayley's turn. Roger. Go 21 from Mr. Chippy, we're now at the five mile point. Roger, we've got you at the five mile point, so this is a Sophie 2000 multi norm, um, 4 watts on this band, uh, 2.13 amps being drawn, and we're going to go over to CPT, and I'll see you on channel 31, CPT FM, over. Yep, Roger that, see you shortly. Okay. Tango 21 for Mr. Chippy, now on CPT channel 31 FM. Roger, got you on channel 31 CPT FM. A bit more background noise, and the turn of up to two notches on this. So we'll go with the AM now, over. Yep, roger that, will do. Tango 21 for Mr. Chippy, now on CPT 31 AM. Yeah, 
it's a bit hit and miss. There's a lot of interference on the band, so uh, you were clear at first and then not so clear. Roger. Tango 21, Mr Chippy, back on UK FM 31. Tango 21, Roger, yes that's fine, I'll see you again when you're ready. Roger, will do. Tango 21, Mr Chippy, we're now at the 5 mile point. Roger, got you at the 5 mile point, so this is a CRT 2000 multi-norm, um, 4 watts on this band, uh, 2.13 amps being drawn. And we're going to go over to CPT and I'll see you on channel 31 CPT FM over. Yep, Roger that, Steve Shortman. Roger. Roger got you on channel 31 CPT FM. A bit more background noise. I had to turn the squelch up two notches on this. So we'll go over to AM now, over. Yep, Roger that, we'll do it. See you there. Roger got you, I just fiddled with the uh, volume once again and ended up changing the mode. Um, yeah, it's pretty crummy at this end, but um, when I edit the video I probably found it sound, sound it quite nice at your end, I don't know. Over. No, it's, uh, it's barely readable this end. Right, we'll go back to UK. Channel 31, and we'll conclude our test over. Of course, it's changing channel now instead of what we want. Uh, we want to go to mode, and we want to turn the squelch down to. Tango 21, Roger, yes that's fine, off you go when you're ready. Roger, hold it. Right, we're on the move again. level crossing. Have you got a petrol price for me at that end please over? Yep, 
Uh, Roger on that. Well, that worked fine. Con that concludes the test. Thank you. Ten ten. So that worked well enough. Certainly does. But um, what a faff to work it. You know, there's nothing intuitive about it. Bring back the uh, LCL Enterprise with uh, on off volume and squelch and channel. Um, yeah, it's not my cup of tea, but there's no criticism of the customer if that's what the customer is wanting. Um, but out of the new sets he's come up with, I still think the Thunderbolt T3000 is the best of the three we've just done. So we'll go over to our Midland base station and we'll see what it sounds like. Tango 21 testing the CRT2000 with its factory original mic into our Midland 76900 base station. Testing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And once again, hope you found that interesting and thanks for watching.